Greetings, and welcome back, Chaos and Sewers, to another episode of Train Fever, and this time we'll be upgrading and updating all of our layout lines. Uh, so this one, we'll start with uh, putting trams that go backwards on the same line. So I never thought about that. So that means we're going to have two lines on this same little route here. So we're going to have to uh, do a new route, and it's going to go backwards so we start with here and we go back this way just like that that way we have one so it's a uh, residential industrial industrial uh, leak leak reverse there we go and we hit enter I forgot to hit enter the last time and uh, I guess we'll add a couple of them to that line. I guess we'll add... I mean, they're not going to make as much money from this other line, so I guess we'll do four. So that way it's not too much in the way. And then we can set them all to that reverse line. Right there. Hopefully that'll increase a little bit. Uh, the next thing, uh, should we do some other ones that don't have a reverse line to them? Like this one does not have a reverse line to it. So, But it's kind of going... Well, this one's not a complete circle, so I guess we can't do it for that one, necessarily. Uh, same thing with this one, it's already going back and forth. I think it's just the ones that go around in a giant circle, like this. Yeah, so if somebody wants to go from here to here, they're not going to get that. Uh, warning, vehicle 25 is in just lifetime, and it's be to replace. Okay, sure, I can do that. Uh, let's go to you. Oh, okay, I didn't mean to like zoom super in. Huntingdon, can I hover over this? It'll show me where it is. Uh, no, I didn't click on it. Ah, there we go. Okay. So we want to be on this one here. And then we just have this. Is So what I've actually read on uh, something is that somebody waited for one of their vehicles to go bad and then all of them go bad uh, so I don't know which oh I can look on the line okay so if I open up this did it open it no okay there we go number 82 and this one's only six months so it's only a couple that are in here so all right we can just have it go to the depot and on that goods line we'll just add another one on that Ray. Speaking of trains, trains going by outside every time, so we'll put one there. Just like that. Okay, uh, do we have any other very loud train horns that are outside? Do we have any other lines that kind of loop in a city? I don't think we do. That one's fine. Oh, is this one here anyway? Where is it? No. I thought I just had one. Yeah, right here. Because that's where the vehicle went bad. Okay. So we can do the line here. Let's get rid of that. So that way that goes away. And it's going this way currently. So we'll start here. And we'll go backwards. Just like that. So we can end there. And we will call this one, of course... Uh, Magic Town that I can't tell the name of. But I wish I could. All right. Well, let's just let's just do that for now. Uh, Luton. Okay. So we can rename this one residential to industrial. Luton reversed. And that'll have that. And we'll put a couple trams on that side. Oops. Didn't want to open that. And we'll put one, two, three, four. Yeah, four is good. And we'll set them to the reverse line there. Oops, there's a delete key. So we can close all of our windows out. And that'll be that. So do we have another one? We were looking this way. Uh, I love all these trucks. <laughs> I never get tired of seeing all those trucks. All right, so those go that way. So that's fine. I think I just checked all of them then, because we did leak. We have towns that are over here that aren't connected. We did this town here. Which, that one's just buses. 
That's the train stop. Uh, that's nothing. Lutton we did. Okay! So it looks like we've done everything. Now, here is the key part. We need to connect some towns from place to place. So why don't we do some really far away stuff? That way we get a maximum amount of passengers that want to go on it. So we're going to pick a station that's really near and close. So we'll pick like here-ish. And I'm very sorry. I'm going to have to uh, destroy some things. Or do I want to just make an extra stop that kind of goes up there? Because I could just edit the line. Uh, well, I have the money. Let's try and edit some lines here. So we're going to make some tramway up there. And my tram moves. I don't understand. Someone please explain why the tram moves. I would love to know. I really would. So we'll come back down here and put another stop right here. Just like that. And then we have to find the line. I have to close this out. Okay, we have to find the route. Oh, perfect. Yellow. Yellow. Yellow, yellow. Okay, it's this one here. Perfect, okay, so I can add a station. Oh, hold on. Let me pause the game. So that way people aren't getting confused. So after Park Lane, I want to go to here. Oh, shoot. Add station. Go there. And then go back to here. Yeah? So we should have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Perfect. Good. Okay. That'll work. Play. And let, th let things go into chaos as we do that. So we're going to delete this thing of road here. Alright, so we can build our train station. Passenger, two tracks. So we can build it right there. Facing that way. Yep, that's what I want. And it's going to come out here and choo-choo all the way down and cross this little mine here. And we're going to go right over to here, into Porthaven. Which seems to be expanding. I should run a tram like from here past over here. Because it kind of goes down into here. But we're gonna go right here if we can delete this little roadway here. So that way we'll be able to attach it here. And I think it's the M and N key. Yep, there we go. I keep forgetting what keys they are. Oh my god, it's already a million bucks just spent uh, right there. And we'll build some roadway out to there. We'll build a cool roadway just like that. And confirm that. Alright. So we still have $6.4 million. <laughs> uh, uh, I think I know why it was so expensive. And I didn't really think that through. But you know what? It's a fun learning experience. And stuff like that's going to happen. So it's fine. Now, the fun part is connecting this whole entire thing all the way over here. So we're going to have to go up above this area here, kind of come through the hill, and make a sharp turn downward. So we're going to kind of want to go straight and then curve up here and then go down there. Okay, simple. Super simple stuff. And then I want to keep this one going away on the right side. Or we could do it like split it and one goes down here and one goes up there. That would be kind of neat too. So, like, one could go from here up, like, through here, and the other one can go through here and kind of, like, down here. That'd be kind of neat. We should try it that way. But it's going to have to have some sort of switch. So we need to make sure that there's switches available. So we're going to make it kind of even at first. We're going to make them a little bit even. So we'll just make a little short track piece, and we'll match that track piece just like that. Oops, lag a little bit. And we'll go again. Keep it 120 as best we can. Go like that. And keep it 120 as best we can. Okay, so now this one, if we remember America Roadways, this way is going that way. So this way is coming back. So it's gonna go from here over to here. Just like that. Okay, so that's taken care of there. All right, so now we could split them off if we really want to. So let's make our way 
down over there. I don't know if I should mash them up or if I should split them up. I think I should split them up. It'd be kind of cool that way. So we'll just make our way slowly and crawl ourselves over there. Hopefully we have enough money to do this. There we go. And we'll slowly keep going. We're actually almost there, to be honest. Uh, we're not too far. Eh, I guess we are kind of far, but we're not really that far. We'll go right there. And we'll build out here. We're just kind of making a cool little train track going on the side of the mountains over here. We're going to cut through some trees. Oh, it's going to be a long train. All right, we're going to have to make it so we go over here. So we kind of cut around this huge mountain area. Because we don't want to go too close to it or else it's going to cost us a lot of money. So we'll kind of just go around here. We'll go around this. Uh, let's, can we... Yeah, terrain collision, that's what I thought. Let's try here. And then let's try here. And then can we make it through here? Oh, of course we can. Cool. Good. And we just have to remember we have to keep these pieces of track together. Actually, let's do this. Let's get rid of this. And we'll make sure that we have some track coming out from here that's even. So hopefully we can do that. Uh-oh. Alright, so we want to make it as even as we can coming out here, which is fine. And we'll match this piece of track up right there. Okay, and it's coming in this way, so it's going to go in this station. So in this station, we want to make it so that way it comes out over here at 120. Perfect. Boom. Okay. So that we can just quickly connect to there, which it was on its way. Which is good. We want to take the second side track, connect it right to there. And then this one will take on this journey over here. And we'll get rid of this road here. So that way we can come over this way. Give me some train track again. Lock on that end piece. There we go. And we'll come over this way. Just like this. Look at that. That's going to look cool. So it's going to come out here. Connect out. Uh, we could come out further if we want. So we could just go straight from here. We can kind of just go this way. Just like this. And we'll just go straight this way. Just like that. We'll just make a cool little straight path. Probably crash right into that. Oh no, we're not going to crash into the industry. Good. Come out here. More out here. More out here. More out here. And are we going too far? Nope, we're still good. Because we want to kind of like snake our way around this little thing here. Just like that. And we're still at six point how many million? Perfect. 20, look at that, and we're going to kind of curve back over. Oh, I fucked that up pretty good. Alright, so we have to do that. Okay, and we have to screw this piece. And then that should match up. Oh yeah, look at that. Cool. Alright, so town to town. We got that going. We're going to need a lot of trains here. A lot of trains. Uh... I don't know. One should be okay. How far away are these? If I go like this, they're about... So I can't see them on here. When we did this one, could we see them on here? Yeah, we could see them on here. Hmm. That is a little tough to say if I want to put... Well, I mean, technically I can see them. It is a little tough to say if I want to put anything on this in terms of more engines. I guess we could find out. We'll just make a new line. One. And. Two. And it's going to use that line, but we'll change that by closing this out. Going back to this little signal construction. I forget how the signals work. So you're going to have to bear with me. I want to say they work. God. Okay, wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. I could just look at this other track over here. We're fine. I just have to use a reference. So we use a signal. We use a signal there. Bef 
for the switch and that's on the right side and then we use the signal here and they're just on the outsides okay so if I keep them on the outsides it should automatically do it for me so I'll go over here and I'll do them on the oh god this track is really long I'll do them on the outsides so there and there and then if we come over here and do them on the outsides it should change back so if we do them here and here no did I screw it up hmm did I not do it right should I put them on the inside too did I do that right no uh-oh, now we have an issue. <laughs> I don't think I did it right. Uh-oh. Come back over here. We'll put them on the inside over here. Do they have to go on the inside, maybe? And I just messed it up? Do they just go on the inside? No? Uh-oh. No, it didn't change. Hmm. This isn't fun. Okay, get rid of that. Get rid of that. Let's zoom over here. I'm just trying to see how I can... Oh. 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 No. Okay. Just went to the other side, I guess. Okay. So if I face the signal the opposite way, here, if I face it like this, oops, if I face it like this, a train won't go in here. It'll go in there, or not. Okay. If I place one going this way, it shouldn't go in here. Ah, yeah, there we go. Okay, okay, okay. We're making sense now. Now we've got it. We've got this. Perfect. Okay. Now we've got some cool stuff going on here. That took a little bit. <laughs> okay. So we have to remember, any signal we want, we put on here. Because it's going to go in here. Right? Okay, good. Now we put one here, because the train's going to wait here, there, and we put one here, because the train's going to go this way. Okay, yes, we're still good. Excellent. Cool. Alright, let's see how one train fares on this track, or two trains fare on this track. And if it's not enough, then we will add more. So we can close this. We're going to have to build a train depot somewhere. It can't be here, because it's next to the city. We can't build it over here. Uh, yeah, we can. Where's this route going? Uh, it's on the right side of the track. Or not. It got all messed up. It's all messed up because of the hill. But it, I think it's on this one. Got me all confused. Yeah, it is on the right side. Okay. Because this right side goes in right here. Yeah, okay, okay. I've got this. Where is my train depot? There it is. Cool. And then we'll just assign them to the routes. And that'll be that. So let's buy some trains here. We'll buy the Prussian G3. And we'll give it some compartment cars. Yes, uh, how many do I want to do? Let's do one, two, three, four. Five. Why not? Let's do five. And we'll set it to line one since I didn't name it yet. And we'll wait for that one to go. And we'll rename our line. This is going to be lid 
to Porthiven. Okay, oops, that's locating it. Not S. We don't want S. Lid to Porthiven. Cool. Close that up. Actually, let's, uh... Where's my train? Where's... Not that. Not that. This? No. This? No. This? No. Oh. I'm dumb. Okay. So we have six compartment cars. These are still using those old cars. Oh, wait. That's good. My bad. Okay, these are still using those old cars. The Bavarian car. So that we could probably get up. Oh. Oh. The only thing not making money is iron ore. This vehicle's still incoming? Oh, I have to sell it. Whoops. My bad. How do I sell? Am I dumb? Uh-oh. I've forgotten how to sell a vehicle. Oh, I have to go to it. There we go. My mistake. All right, so that's going pretty nicely. 44 kilometers an hour, 45. Which its top speed is capable of what? Hold on, I just want to look at this. I'll look at it from this way. Yeah. That looks cool. <laughs> All the smoke. All the smoke and everything looks neat. Oh, and even going by a train crossing. Oh, where's my button to take a picture? I missed it. Oh, oh well. Too late now. So we'll go over here and set up our another train. This one I won't miss taking a picture. Uh, 50 kilometers an hour is our top speed for this one. Two, three, four, five. And same thing. Set it for that line. Oh, look at that. People are building. Excellent. That's what I like to see. So that one will wait until that train comes down all the way over here. I think we're going to need a couple more trains, to be honest. I think we're going to need a couple more. So, in anticipation for that, let's just build some signals. Kind of just one here, one here, one here, there, 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 there. Oh, a little bit of lag. There, there, so many signals, but it's okay. I have the money to afford them. There, and then we'll put some right here, one right here, one right there, one right there, one right there, one right here, another one over here. Oh, you're in the way, okay, that's cool. One right there, can I build one in front of you? Sure, one right there, one right here, one right here, one there, okay. All right, signal overload. Good enough for me. Oh, that's a lot of signals. How much money did we just waste putting signals on? Who cares? That's the good answer. Oh, look, it's coming. Here, wait, wait. I'm not missing my chance to get a screenshot. Hold on. Pause the game. Pause it. Okay. I'm going to sit right here. I'm going to close my menus out. Uh, close. Close. Okay. I'm going to sit right here. Then I'm going to go over here. I'm going to put my mouse over here. And I have to find out my Steam screenshot button, which is this button right here. And I'm going to hit play. And I'm going to wait for the train to come by. I'm going to kind of angle it up a little bit. And we're going to watch this thing. Look at that. It's so beautiful. It's so majestic. Excellently coming into frame. And I love it. Perfect. Excellent shot. Cool. Alright, let's add one more. So we'll click this. Buy more. One. One, two, three, four, five. Set line. Bam. Done. All right, so let's that uh, three. I should probably go four. Probably should go four, because this is a big line. 
There are no people waiting yet because they don't know that it's connected to them. But all roads, there should be a road path connecting to them, which should make it realize that they're part of the system. Yeah, there's a road going there, going there. Okay, so hopefully they realize they're part of the system and they kind of want to use that line there. So hopefully that'll work. And I think we'll call it for this episode. Join me on the next one where we'll expand even more. We have more trains to build, more lines to do, and all that sort of good stuff. So thanks for watching.